rolling. All right, Noah, we're on the way to EG for, um, I don't know what session, our 10th session or so. Yep. It's been a couple of weeks since the last one. The last one was right before your, right after your play. Yeah. So what's new? Anything going on? Um, uh, well, I'm in another show. It's the um, end of the year show, the senior show. And yeah. we have all the seniors in drama write that show. And then they cast everybody else, and we all perform it. It's very fun. I have non-speaking roles, but... Um, For now. But they're very good roles in that they're reacting parts. And I'm very good with reacting, reacting stuff. Excellent. And uh, how's school? The school part of school? school part of school is actually very good. Yeah? Yeah. And I'm working on making it better as well. How's that? I mean, is there a strategy involved in that, or just sort of general... Moreness. Goal. General moreness, I would say. General moreness? Yes. Not morning, but moreness. Moreness. I get it. How are you sleeping? Sleeping fine. You were sleeping fine before, though, right? Yeah. What game are you going to play today? Or what, what thing? Because there's something you haven't even tried yet. Like other games? I mean, you did the Dune Buggy, and you did the Jet Ski, and there's a lot of the Rocket, and you did a movie. There's also one called, like, Cube or something, where... It just fills in the screen with these little shapes uh -huh. to make these pictures. You sort of watch, it's kind of like a screensaver that you watch. Right. I mean, typical like that. It's like pictures of polar bears and stuff. I don't know. I think we'll go with the spaceship again. Spaceship? The good old spaceship? Spaceship's my favorite. <laughs> you did a double session though, today, you know? Yeah. Back to back. So you could leave with like a giant throbbing head like in Star Trek, you know? Unlikely, but you never know. So I wonder if we'll ever get into the Alpha Theta training, which is a whole other kind of training. Really? Where they put headphones on you and a blindfold, and it's all just sound and vibration from the teddy bear. Uh -huh. And it puts you in this really it's in this really deep theta wave state, which is like a dream state. Cool. That is really good for things like post-traumatic stress disorder, where you've got to really fix something in your head. Which I don't I don't think Necessarily, it's necessarily happen. Thing you need. I don't know. Well, we should ask about that. That'd be a cool thing to do. It, it certainly doesn't hurt anything. I mean, all the people who took the training that I saw did it to themselves, you know, just right. to feel it, see what it was like. I would totally do it. I would be up for it. The deep theta training. <laughs> yeah. And like, I, and that's where the zero powers come from. And I wake up. And all my stuff is moved. All the stuff in my room is moved to different places. All the stuff in your room is like hovering, like a foot off the desk. And you wake up and it goes crew and it all crashes down. You're like I'm. Huh. I wake up and the bed is hovering. Bonk. Hovering. You step on the bed, you like land flat on the ground because the bed's a foot higher. <laughs> like these are all movie scenes, you know. It's all this cinematic <laughs> response to. Yeah, well, we both generally think in very cinematic ways. Coming down to let us in. Ah, there he there is. There he is. Thank there you. Is. There we go. That's the spirit. This guy has flaps. And then we went to WonderCon last weekend, which was good fun. Yeah. And always my cameraman down there. Mm -hmm. For Professor Puppet. Also, so you see him from the outside, you see him as maybe calmer? Um, well, yeah. I mean, calmer than he was before we started, absolutely. But it's been like, a, it's pretty gradual. It's been like kind of a gradual thing. Mm -hmm. It's not like suddenly it just switched. Right. Maybe at the very beginning it sort of felt like that. But, you know, it just, he seems totally cool. Yeah, and you and used to. I mean, the good news is, even though we've only done a half a dozen sessions, is that he's not losing any of it. Right. Right. So that that's the big thing. You're still not taking any uh, Adderall, right? Concert. Concerta. You're not taking Concerta. Not taking Concerta. You're just taking the, the fast-acting... Morning Ritalin, right? Yeah. And so what do you think about focus? That was the big issue when we started. Um, not nearly as scattered, and um, I'm able to hold my attention to boring tasks for a lot longer. That's great. Because school yeah. gives you some of us. Yeah. Is the Alpha Theta training called for at any time during this, this series of things, or is it not really appropriate? Maybe not a priority. Maybe not so necessary. Uh-huh. Um, the Alpha Theta is a process where the feedback takes you to a deep state and holds you there. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it allows people to process unresolved experiences, 
because you know bad experiences, traumatic experiences, or just difficult experiences can kind of come up and bite you later. Somebody calls you stupid, and then you're trying to do the same thing later, and you, that little voice in your head says you're probably not going to do a good job, kind of thing. So right. it's cleaning out some of the garbage that can hold us back. Um, you know, with kids, it's really a matter of getting them on track physiologically, and everything else goes. With adults, they almost always benefit from alpha theta. So for teenagers, could go either way. Mm -hmm. By either way, you mean do it or not do it. Do it or not, not like it could be great or it could be terrible. No, no, no. It's not going to hurt anybody. It's yeah. just a question of whether it's efficient. But it would be interesting simply for the experience of doing it. Okay. Okay. But what we want to do is more of this for a while. Let's right. get at least yeah. 10 sessions into this. Okay. And Definitely. then we can talk about it. Because it is really an interesting experience. through a double session or anything, he's getting a little zoned out. Well, I don't know, because um, I always know that there's one, I think it's the common one, that just makes it kind of hard to stay, keep my eyes open. Because you get super calm? Mm-hmm. like a little bit more of a struggle today somehow. I'm not sure why, just to get that impression. Yeah. I don't know why either. Was it or was it just my impression? Well I mean for some reason I'm just a little tired today. Yeah. Like, like are you not as into it today? No, I was into it. I was actually really looking kind of looking forward to it. On the mental end of this particular issue I'm very aware, and I'm very, you know, awake, and kind of rested in my life, but physically, I'm tired. But like mentally, you feel like... Aware, and focused. Like focused, and tight, and tight. mentally sharp. I feel like watching a movie with a little feral that's all in Spanish. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> 